सेल्स एंड प्रोडक्ट्स ऑफ सेल्स एंड प्रोडक्ट्स ऑफ सेल्स इट मीन्स इन ऑल लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम्स आर मेड अप ऑफ सेल्स एंड प्रोडक्ट्स ऑफ सेल्स ओके सो बट दे डू नॉट एक्सप्लेन दैट हाउ दैट ओके सो ओल्ड सेल्स आर अराइज बट दे डू नॉट एक्सप्लेन how the new cells are arise so that is known as the demerit that's why they do not providing a final shape to the cell theory after that rudolf virchow scientist give final shape to cell theory he explained that okay so this cells are formed from that free existing cells by the cell division he explained that he explain cells arise from pre existing cells so in latin language that is known as amnis cellula and e cellula amnis cellulae and e cellulae so amnis cellulae and e cellulae means so cells arise from pre existing cells by cell division so it is also known as that cell lineage theory it's so objective bit omni cellular and e cellular it is a previous medical bit right so it means according to that cell theory it is a cell theory explain that finally all cells are all living organisms are made up of cells and products of cells cells and products of cells second one new cells arise or daughter cells arise new cells or daughter cells arise from pre existing cells that's why so that is known as that cell theory components all living organisms are made up of okay so all living organisms are made up of cells and products of cells new cells are arise from that pre existing cells so next cell is the
स्ट्रक्चरल एंड फंक्शनल यूनिट ऑफ ऑर्गेनिज्म ओके दैट इज नोन एज पॉइंट्स अबाउट दैट सेल थियरी After that, an overview of cell. So we observe that it means two types of the cells. Okay, what is the difference between that plant cell and animal cell? For example, you take. onion peel so after then it is observed with the microscope so it is appeared that plant cell so after that human cheek cell that is known as that animal cell in that plant cell in that animal cell so in that plant cell having that outside cell wall and it is followed by cell membrane but in that animal cell outer thin layer is outer thin membrane is present that is known as a plasma membrane plasma membrane or cell membrane it is a delimiting structure cell wall providing boundary to the cell cell wall is boundary to cell in plant cell is boundary to plant cell okay after that so we observe that in prokaryotic cell and eukaryotic cell in both in prokaryotic cell and eukaryotic cell inside having semi fluid matrix this is semi fluid matrix is known as that cytoplasm 